Hey what's up everybody, Team SNES here with a brand new glitch on the game LEGO Star Wars The Force Awakens. In this video we're going to show you how to do the Universal Barrier Breaker. Now you may hear some popping in the background or explosions. Don't worry, I'm not being attacked, it's just 4th of July. Which we here at Team SNES wish you a happy 4th of July. Let's begin the tutorial. Step 1, find a cramped space and jump in there with BB-8 so you get in there as tight as possible. Whoa, that's what she said. Step 2, choose a large character, which in my case is Grimgar. Notice how you're halfway in the wall. Now simply just inch to the side a little bit more and be careful because you will fall into the map. Now we're going to switch to Boba Fett because he has an awesome jetpack that will help us get around. Observe. Do your best to land in this exact location. Now you're out of the map, free to explore any and everything you wish. One thing I noticed is the Millennium Falcon is pretty much outside the majority of the map, so get used to seeing this bad boy out here. On to the next glitch. We just entered Chapter 4, the Aravana, the Frighter Showdown. When you spawn in, you're going to head to the left. You're going to climb this wall with Ray. Destroy this component until it disappears. Now jump in this exact location you see me at. Now choose a large character. Now switch to the other player. Bring them up here and jump on top of this component. Now choose a character that has a gun. Doesn't matter who, as long as they have a gun. Now blast the big guy until he dies. Once he dies, he should spawn halfway into the ceiling. Now you're going to switch back to the big guy and just hop over and land on this barrier. Yeah, I know, the camera view is awful. I wish I can fix it for you, but unfortunately I can't. So we're going to be Boba Fett again because of his awesome jetpack. Now you're going to jetpack around this wall right here and come close to the map, but not too close so you pop back in. And again, I know the camera view is awful. You can't see anything, but just observe and do your best. Once you land on flat surface, head this way and you are now out of the map. And hey, what do you know? The Millennium Falcon again. What a coincidence. This glitch was found by SNES and X Shadow EX Miss here at Team SNES. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that subscribe button, give us a like, or comment, and let us know what you thought about the video. Happy 4th of July, everybody. Team SNES out.